just the tips to make your accountant life easier using AtMe. Um, so at this event, uh, we already pre-created this event so that we can get into what really matter. So to make your account life easy, usually you want to be able to export the data and when somebody buy a ticket, you already have all the necessary info uh, available. So for example, if, if, if you creating, um, so the first thing I got to do is creating a, an input field. Um, so uh, for example, if there is a department code, okay. Um, and then it's a uh, text field, for example. Um, we save that, and uh, obviously we don't want to make it visible because this is just internal use only. Uh, you can have, you know, GL, for example, um, and then also a text field, okay? And um, you can have, you know, fun type, right? Also a text field. Right? And then what you do is on the ticketing, when you want to assign specific department code to a ticket, you can do it here. So basically under tickets, you go to advanced settings and then you assign this a default value. For example, department code is 522. Uh, a GL code, a default value of you know, 4200. Uh, and fun is uh, the code is 70 for example now suddenly uh, when you save this and somebody bought a ticket later um, if you go to the tickets you can see that it's not there the, the information is not there but when somebody bought a ticket it will automatically assign that default value if you go into the back end and you look at the event and attendees you can see now if you you know select the the you know the optional field that we have you can see that it's been you know automatically filled in with the uh, appropriate default value for each field that you created